Hi guys, it's Carrie with Fullerton Professional Organizing here in the Rio Grande Valley. And we're going to talk about Clarity and Calm Closet Cleanse for fall and winter in the bottom tip of Texas. Now, as the seasons change from the warm sunny days of summer to the cooler or maybe not so cooler maybe soon spring ish feelings <laughs> in the winter these cozy cozy vibes of fall and winter it's the perfect time to refresh your closet at the bottom tip of texas where temperatures can vary significantly transitioning your wardrobe can feel like a major task here in the bottom tip of texas or anywhere in the country really however a well-organized and seasonal ready closet can bring you a lot of clarity and calmness to your daily routine now here's how to perform a fall and winter closet cleanse that will leave you feeling organized and prepared for the maybe somewhat cooler maybe months I mean here it gets cold in November warm in December and then maybe gets a little cooler in January February maybe still March but we don't wear a lot of sweaters and coats here all right but let's go ahead and anyway and start with a clean slate okay now there's two ways you can tackle this i do not empty out my entire closet and start with a completely clean slate but what i do is i start with sections i will tackle shoes i will tackle drawers one at a time i will tra uh, tackle um, one section of my closet at a time so it's not completely overwhelming but if you are the type that you can start with an empty closet then begin by completely emptying your closet this is, will allow you though even if you do it section by section this will allow you to see everything you have and it will allow you to start fresh so take out all your shoes put them all in color order so you can see what you have a lot of in each color whether or not you can let go of any of them lay all items out and then you're going to sort and categorize group items into categories such as tops bottoms outerwear accessories and shoes this will help you assess what you have and make decisions more easily and um that's why you can start with all your tops put lay them all out and assess all your bottoms and assess outerwear and assess so you can do actually one category at a time now evaluate and declutter assess each item review each item for its condition its fit and its relevance to your lifestyle your job your daily activities ask yourself if it's something you've worn recently and if it fits your current style and lifestyle try on the clothes try on key pieces to ensure they still fit well and are <clears throat> sorry comfortable let me get a drink <clears throat> Hmm. okay sorry ask yourself if it's something you've worn recently and if it fits your current style and lifestyle <coughs> this is especially important for items 
you haven't worn in a while. Try them on. Do they still fit? <coughs> now, go on to the next step, which is declutter. Set aside items that are outdated, no longer fit, or haven't been worn in the past year. Donate, sell, or recycle these pieces to make space for the items you love and will wear. Now, I do not suggest that you sell or recycle these items if you're never going to get to it. If you are the type that takes action and you post those and you sell them and you recycle and you're good at getting that done, then do it. If you're not, go ahead and donate them um, or go ahead and post them on your phone for sale and get it done. If these things don't get done within a month, donate them. Now, organization for the season. Let's go on and talk about that. Fall and winter wardrobe Move your summer clothes to the back of the closet or into storage bins if you don't have room for all of your clothes in the closet. Bring forward your fall and winter clothes, including sweaters, coats, boots, and scarves. Two, seasonal rotation. Organize your fall and winter items by type and frequency of use. For example, place everyday day items like jeans and sweaters at the front and keep special occasion pieces or bulky coats further to the back as long as they're in front of the summer clothes. Create zones. Designate specific areas in your closet for different types of clothing. For instance, a lot space for workwear casual wear and your special occasion outfits all right next we're going to maximize the closet space use one use storage solutions invest in storage solutions like shelf dividers drawer organizers bins and baskets hanging racks to maximize the space and keep everything accessible. Two, vacuum sealed bags. For bulky items like winter coats or off-season clothing, consider using vacuum sealed bags to save space and keep items dust free. You can put all your summer clothes in there until you're ready to pull them out again. Three, hooks and racks. Install hooks or racks on the back of your closet door or on unused wall space for accessories, bags, or hats. Now, let's maintain the space to make it more functional. Let's create some systems. Label bins and shelves. Use labels to clearly identify your bins and shelves. Make it easier to find and return items to their designated spots. Two, regularly, regularly <laughs> maintain. Schedule your regular closet maintenance, ideally at the start of each season, to keep things organized and decluttered. Seasonal check-in. At the end of each season, review your wardrobe to assess what worked well and what needs to be adjusted for the next season. Always keep a, keep a donation basket in your closet. So when you try things on and you don't like them and you know you're not going to wear them, you can put them right in the donation basket throughout the year. Now, in enhance your closet experience make it um, a little bit nicer by adding lighting good lighting can make a huge difference install bright LED lights or a stylish light 
fixture to help you see and appreciate your wardrobe a little better. And incorporate fresh scents. Place a sachet or something that smells good, a few cedar blocks into your closet to keep your clothes smelling fresh and detour pests. Three, personal touches. Add personal touches like decorative boxes, a small rug, or a stylish bench to make your closet feel inviting and organized. All right, guys, ready to embrace a clutter-free fall and winter? A well-organized closet can make transitioning between seasons a breeze and bring a sense of calm to your daily routine. If you need help decluttering and organizing your wardrobe, contact Fullerton's Professional Organizing. Our team specializes in creating tailored solutions for closets, for closets ensuring your space is both functional and stylish. All right, guys, I will see you on the next podcast. Just be sure you transform your closet into a haven of clarity and calm with Fullerton's professional organizing. Embrace the season with a wardrobe that's organized, accessible, and perfectly suited to the cooler months ahead. See you on the next one.